Hey everyone, our startup is Aware, and we are developing the ultimate smart sleep watch. We seek to revolutionize the way people stay awake, and at the same time, we want to optimize your sleeping schedule. All right, so very quick question. How many of you guys have ever fell asleep whilst you're trying to study, or whilst you're in class, in a lecture, anything, or you know, want to do something very important, like all of us, right? So when we first stumbled upon this problem, we actually had to validate our assumptions by doing extensive market research. And what we discovered is that a staggering 8 out of 10 students actually find this a problem. Now this is worrisome, and in a way, we discovered this is an opportunity. So we went into the world of the tech sector and decided to look at the trends there, and it's phenomenal. 16.9% annual growth rate, and a staggering $25 billion, but we want to focus on the niche market that is currently at $7.5 billion and really focus on the high school students and the college students that are currently plagued by this problem. So our solution to this huge problem is AWARE. It functions just like a regular watch would, but at the same time it will track all your vital sleep information. More importantly, however, it will actually wake you up when you doze off through a series of powerful, rapid vibrations. These vibrations, they can only be turned off with the shake of your arm. This ensures that the user will stay awake after they think they woke up. As you can also see, we have an app developed. It connects to our wearable de device via Bluetooth, and it'll display all the data it receives, and at the same time provide some extra functionality, such as the option to have a power nap or manage your sleep schedule. So, we are obviously not alone in this industry. Now, I know what you're thinking, you're probably asking yourself, how do we differentiate ourselves from the rest of uh, the wearables? Well, as you can see from this chart, Aware still outranks both its competitive, all its competitors in both effectiveness and affordability. We are the only wearable device that has an advanced sleep tracking system and a reliable, discreet smart alarm system while still being affordable to the everyday consumer. So, in terms of our viability, we've already went ahead and developed a prototype with Arduino. Currently, it features a sensor that can detect your pulse, and it has a motor that can vibrate when your pulse drops, which indicates that you are falling asleep. In addition, uh, we realized that our prototype wasn't that accurate, so we went ahead and developed an Apple Watch counterpart app, just, not, not counterpart, just an Apple Watch app, to prove the technical feasibility. After working on proving our viability, we worked on generating this factory for our business. And one main way we did this was through creating a website. On this website, we used Google Analytics to track user excitement. And we learned a lot of cool things. One of them being that we saw that over 20 people actually clicked the pre-order button. Now this tells us two things. One, that we are solving a real problem that a number of people face. And two, that these people, our customers, were actually willing to pay us for our solution. So we know that we have the right team to make this business a reality because we are all passionate, driven, and have, a diver and have diverse skill sets. We come from all around the world and bring in different perspectives and skills. Hugo handles our operations and he lives in Boston. Victor came here all the way from Zimbabwe and he takes care of our finances. Rehan lives in California and takes care of software, and I myself live up north in Toronto, Canada and take care of hardware. So the lifeline of any business is money, and at Aware, we are very much aware of our financial numbers. So starting off with our unit cost, every device will go for $70, and that will be directly to our e-commerce side. Initially, our cost of production and logistics of actually uh, shipping that to consumers is $55, but we hope that number to come down in the 50th to $30, owing to economies of scale. And we plan on launching this through Kickstarter and other channels aggressively so that we can penetrate the market efficiently. $70 is well within the, the minimum price range of most of these wearable devices. In terms of future steps, we want to start out by starting a Kickstarter campaign to increase excitement and raise funding for a product. Next, we would like to sell our product through online and e-commerce uh, e and uh, retail eventually. And then after that, we want to market our technology to drivers to prevent uh, drowsy driving accidents. Finally, we want to partner with Uber and truck driving companies to mandate our technology for their drivers to keep them safer. 
Follow us on social media, check out our website, and don't forget to be aware.